What's up everybody? Dan O'Sullivan at Bucks Island right here in the loft. I know that was a little loud and exciting, but I get so geeked about tackle. I'm a tackle junkie, a tackle geek. I would play with tackle all day long. Sometimes catch a few bass on it too. But anyway, it's time for what's new in the loft right here at Bucks Island. We're always looking for the new funky fresh stuff. Some of this stuff came straight out of ICAST this year. If you saw my advanced angler coverage, lots and lots of videos with lots and lots of stuff. Some of it's already arrived, and that's a good thing. So, let's start with swim baits. We got a full selection of bull shad. I know you guys know about bull shad, Mike Buka, Triton Mike Buka. He likes to throw these on Pickwick and really have a good time all over the country these things have been we got the four by fours we got the herrings we got all the different slow sink fast sink different colors we've got the the bull shads to help you get those big bites that you need believe it or not that's about the size of a super spook so people that say a swim bait is too big uh -uh. a super spook is about that exact same size and a two pounder will eat that thing all day long they'll eat that too so anyway this is a wake bait type version here and you've got the herring we've got a million of them over there different sizes this was uh, this was launched at iCast smoke on the water Brian thrift come with the big blade chatterbait that's a musky size blade on a chatterbait we'll send that thing crazy vibration big wide hunting action this is a great deal with an oversized bait sold a bunch of these things already this is gonna be the deal with a bigger bigger trailer give you a bigger profile in the water so that's another thing that was out iCast Another thing that we saw at iCast was the Strike King Chick Magnet, flat-sided crankbait, comes straight out of Tennessee. Andy Morgan had a bunch to do with this kind of deal. Flat sides, cold water, if you don't know how that works, tight wiggle, get your bites. And around here on the Coosa River and some of our other bodies of water, anytime the fish are shallow, which is year round, cold water, chick magnet, thin side, flat side, crankbait, tight wiggle, draw strikes. Speaking of Strike King, we got all of the fire cross stuff that came in. Here we've got KVD 1.5 and 2.5 square bills. We've got the Thunder Cricket in the fire cross color. Even has the orange blade with the, pec the black speckles on it. That's a great deal. And then we got the uh, blade minnows in here too to put as a tra uh, trailer on your Thunder Cricket. Really completes the package so in that dirty water and in the springtime, Big, big deal right there. Um, that's something that you'll have to check out. Uh, we got our Bucks Island exclusive, thanks to the guys at Reaction Innovations. This is the spicy beaver in a color you will find nowhere else. Spring break. This looks like a bikini on a tan body. That's all I'm gonna say. I think that's why they named it Strike King, but I'm, or named it Spring Break. But I might be a little conspiracy minded on that one. But I kind of know the guys over there, so maybe that's what they did. But this is the great action of the spicy beaver in a color you won't get anywhere else in the country. Right here, exclusive. Um, also, from Strike King, we got the full line of the mid-range bugs. Coosa River, they want little smaller profile pieces. So a lot of times, yeah, you can catch them on those big baits, especially the largemouth in the, in the grass and around the current. But that mid-profile piece still gives you the ability to put a three-out hook in there, flipping hook, and still present a good profile but a smaller profile that'll get you bites on the coosa river try this one this is one of my favorite colors this is bama craw put the little blue in there on your jig a little chartreuse on the claws i love that that bait right there um speaking of jigs here's one we've got in this is talon lures out of milam texas uh, these people make works of art uh, this is absolutely one we've wanted to bring in for a while. We've got the Yu-Gi-Oh swim jig. We also have another one that's a bling swim jig that's coming with a blade on the tail. You don't even put a trailer on that one. It's got a little willow leaf blade that tails behind it. That one's going to be here soon. But the Yu-Gi-Oh swim jig. We've got the Billy Mac flipping jig right here. This one, short shank, hook, big wide gap. This one drills them and keeps them. Great looking jig for Billy Mac, Billy McKagren. Uh, former Elite Series Pro and a FLW Pro fishing the Bassmaster Opens and then we've got the Talon football jig. Now here's the deal on these. Every color is unique. They 
put a, a ton into them. You may have five, six, seven different layers in these, but they hand tie everything. They powder coat everything. They put great hooks in them. Out of Milam, Texas, so you know it has to hook. It has to hold because those big Texas fish, they will tear you up just like our fish at Gunnersville and the ones out there in California. So a full line of flipping jigs, swim jigs, and the football jigs from Talon Lures. It's actually Talon Custom out of Milam, Texas. We've got these new in the loft. Um, the new tour grade spinner baits from Strike King. Whoa, he fell. The new tour grade spinner baits. We got four new combinations, including this little tiny finesse deal right here. This is great in the backs of pockets, multiple colors. And this is the compact, which has the hidden weight. Uh, if you think War Eagle finesse, that's kind of the, the realm, but it still gives you a good giant hook. That's a really good hook for landing big fish. Okay, let's turn to a reel. We're stocked up again on the Pro SLP or the skip and pitch reel from Lou's. We got left-handed and right-handed. I fished this. This absolutely does what it says it's going to do. So you get your you get your reel set to the you know the level you want on this spool speed, and then you've got a little adjustment in here that there's a skipping zone right here. So you can put it on zero or you can turn it up. And when you're in the skipping zone, it helps to slow this spool down. Holds 40 yards of 20 pound fluorocarbon. This helps to skip. And if you do get a backlash, which is rare, you only have a few little strands to pick off and go back to fishing. But I've used this reel quite a bit. It really does what it says it's gonna do. Small, compact, light, but strong. This works out really well with those uh, skipping jigs from Strike King. I also like to use the Missile Baits Mini Flip Jig paired with this new Missile Baits Mini D-Chunk. Now I'm gonna keep these nice and safe and protected for somebody here, but this thing matches perfectly with a small jig right here. I probably could have picked a better color for you, but it's got appendages on here that flap and kick. This is a good swim jig color. It's going to pair with their Mini, mini Flip. With the Mini Flip, because of the barb system, I like to use the, the, the Rapid Fishing Solutions a hook all and put that on there to help keep this thing flat. I thread the hook up through here. The tails stick out perfectly, but it's also when as soon as they arrive, you'll know the uh, the new mini swim that's coming from Missile Jigs. Uh, John and Ike put that thing together. I've actually fished that too. What a sweet little morsel that thing is, but it pairs perfectly with the mini swim. So you can flip the mini flip jig or you'll be able to swim the new uh, mini swim with the mini D chunk. Totally sick trailer to put on a jig. Um, okay, I know a lot of you guys end up hurting after a day of fishing. You got line cuts and fish scars and maybe you hooked yourself. Um, the guys at Angler Aid have come up with these first aid kits. You got a 53 piece kit here, an 88 piece kit here, and a 101 piece kit. These include braided line for the line tricks uh, to, re to remove a hook. They include little, you know, saws that look like a garrote, Q tips, earplugs, th there's gauze, there's all kinds of stuff in here. It also comes with, and we carry this too, this is something I've actually used for quite a few years. It includes a bottle of, a small bottle of the Angler Aid spray. So, Here's the great thing about this. You get a sunburn while you're out there. Spray this on your face, let it dry. Spray this on your face, let it dry. Your hands, your arms, whatever it is. And it helps to relieve some of the stress of the, the sunburn and, and kind of helps it to smooth and heal a little bit better. Um, but you can use this on, on line cuts. You can use it on happy thumb, I call it. And if they're really big, you get happy hand. You can spray it on there a couple times at night before you go fishing. Your hands feel completely different. But sunburns, cuts, burns, uh, rug rashes from falling on the, the deck of the boat while you're fighting a big fish. That stuff will help. Brandon Polinick works, works with these guys. This is great stuff. I've used it for several years. It absolutely helps. And finally, we've got the new frogs from Scum Frog. This is the uh, trophy series. We also have the launch frog that's here. Um, and we have the uh, Snag Proof Fat Frog, multiple colors. This is the new re-innovation, re-engineering of Snag Proof. 
This has got super soft, consistent bodies with realistic paint jobs. And we've got the Bobby's Perfect Frog. All of these are right here at Bucks Island in the loft. Come check them out, because we know you like tackle just as much as I do, and you like putting fish in the boat. So we have what you need to put those fish in the boat, bounce them on the carpet, slime your whole boat with them. We got the stuff.